Meanwhile, a local community college is making plans to shut down one of its campuses. Hundreds of students affected by this taking place at the end of the school year. Here we're talking about Middlesex Community College. News 8's Kent Pierce is live in uh, Meriden with the reason why and what it means for those students. Kent? Good morning, Teresa and Jim. Middlesex Community College main campus is in Middletown, but they've had this building here in downtown Meriden right across from the police station and the court since 1979. The idea being more convenient for students. Anybody who lives in Meriden or maybe Wallingford and Cheshire, they don't have to drive all the way to Middletown to take classes. The problem this year is next year's budget from Governor Malloy. It cuts more than $20 million out of the budget for the community college system in the state of Connecticut. And frankly, they were already struggling to make do with the money they had this year. So because of those major budget constraints, the president of Middlesex Community College put Putting out a statement yesterday saying she's got no choice but to close the Meriden branch of Middlesex Community College. Now, the Hartford Current reports that 647 students were enrolled in classes here this past fall semester, so it's going to affect a lot of people, and those students will be assisted in finding either another community college or move to classes at the Middletown branch, the Middletown campus, the main campus of Middlesex Community College. What they teach here is mostly high-tech manufacturing processes. If you want to sound off about what you think about these budget cuts and about closing of this building. I looked at the front door of the school and they've got a piece of paper up there that says they've got three forums about the budget coming up next week. The first is 1230 Monday afternoon right here. We're live in downtown Meriden. I'm Kent Pierce. Back to you.